supervisor is calling me. welcome to my channel if you guys are new my name is Jadine and if you guys are not new then of course welcome back and you guys already know who I am um so today I decided to order my groceries on instacart and I'm literally sitting down here waiting for them to get here it says that the lady is already on her way I feel like I made this shopping this shopping experience very smooth and like very easy for her because like all the items that I wanted I had already like chosen replacements for them and if she wasn't able to find the replacement I'm just like it's okay just forget it like it's not that serious especially for the items that were not that serious and the ones that were I made sure that I had those together quickly she's on her way and she's not very far but um I'm this morning I went out to go on a little walk and that was going good until when I went out there it started raining and mind you I had checked the weather before I went but then I'm just like, yeah, it says it's a 30% chance of rain. That doesn't mean it's going to start thundering as soon as I go outside. However, I walked with my umbrella, but when I went outside, it was, it wasn't raining. But like eight minutes into the walk, it started raining and I had to walk back. So I ended up walking for 16 minutes, which, which I think is not terrible. And I'm wondering if I want to go later because right now it's 342. And I'm wondering if I want to go later, but I'm not really sure. But I still have my little workout that I could do. So I think I'm going to end up doing that a little bit later on. And then hopefully that makes up for the fact that I didn't get to walk for 45 minutes like I had planned initially. Or I'm going to have to go at like 6 o'clock just to make sure that I'm inside by like a certain time. Because I don't want to be caught outside. Okay? The lady is probably like... Five. okay she's right there all right so i need to go downstairs to go meet her to collect my groceries and stuff like that so i'll be back oh you guys i think that this has completed my workout for today because i think i made about five trips up and down the stairs to get these things up here now i have to move on to my absolute worst part of grocery shopping i hate putting away the groceries Especially by myself. Really hate that. <laughs> so bad. So high. So, so far, I think I only got one juice and I wanted two. But I've only seen one thus far. So, I think she probably thought that I meant just get me one as opposed to just get me two of the same thing. Oh, I judged her wrongfully. She got me two. Love that. Paper towel. Some bleach. All right, first I have to put away, like the dishes need to go. I also need to replace um, some of the plastic Tupperware that I have underneath here. But I already seen some that I want to buy on Target. The ones that I'm buying are like last. So I just need to actually purchase them. So, I need to message my husband to let him know that I seen something that I want to buy. And I need money to buy it. We'll see how that goes. So I have um paper towel here and bleach. So I'm gonna just do and like wipe off some of these. Because you know bleach kills everything. Or I could just take these out. Guys, I normally buy pineapple because I like to have like the pineapple in the middle of my table, like in the middle of the fruits. So the pineapple in the middle and then the, the other fruits around it. But I find that twice I've bought the pineapple and it stayed there until it like spoiled and like I had to throw it away. I'm not wasting $2.50 or $3. So I didn't buy any this time. I'm being an adult. 
I'm gonna wash these apples. I love the Gala apples. These ones are very big compared to the ones that I currently have on the table. I said 12, two, four, six, eight, nine. And I said 15 oranges. So let's see where the rest of them are. I need to wash these off though. The apples and stuff, I always wash them off. And like just leave them to dry. I feel like I always underestimate how many bags I have. The bell peppers, I also don't um, wash them because I don't want the water to settle and for them to spoil. I think I'm also going to cut them up and put them in the freezer. I wanted to get some green ones, but the lady who was shopping my order, they, she said they didn't have green. So I'm like, just give me two red and two yellow. And then I got six pears. And I'm that person who I always wash my fruits before I eat them. Well, not like the orange, because like I said, the orange, you peel it off anyways. But like my apples and like the pears and stuff like that, I always wash that before I eat it. So the pears, I'm not going to wash either. The things that I feel like might go bad if water is settled on them, I'm not going to wash those. Today, I right now, it's 12.13. Haven't gone on my walk yet. Haven't exercised yet or anything. And I need to back the hell up because I washed my face and I did not put my eczema therapy on. So, we probably have some dry patches going on. Okay, but... That's how it is sometimes, all right? What I wanted to do before, last night I washed my hair and I've been working out now for almost two months, which is good. And I like that I can still get up every day and still do it. Last night I washed my hair and I was just like, yeah, I can't leave it like this because this isn't my best hairstyle, is it? So right now I'm going to fix my twists. I've done the twists before. I just decided to do it a little bit differently this time, which clearly isn't really working out. So I wanted to revamp them this morning because yesterday when I did them, um, I was lazy. And I did them in the shower. And honestly, I was really dying to get out of the shower and to be done. Uh, but I'm going to do it like this. So, part it down the middle, twist, 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 and I'm actually going to put some product on there. This product, I can't really use it with anything else because this one creggles. And I want this to be done, so I'm going to use it for my twists this week. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with the front. I don't know if that's the best idea, but I have the back um, sectioned off in some twists also. So, I want to go ahead and like twist it up and see what we have going on. And I think I'm going to go on my walk later on and then exercise later on. Because the past two days, I've been going on walks. And which last week, I completely didn't. So that was good that I was able to get up this week and actually go. And the today is what? Every day that I've gone so far, it rained. Yesterday. I made it around like the whole section that I'd normally walk and like when I got to the point where I would like turn back and do it um in the reverse because what I did was I walked around right and when I got to the top I had the option of walking straight down or going back the way I came and I wanted to go back the way I came because it was like 25 minutes so that would have been a good walk 25 minutes that way and 25 minutes back and it started raining. Started damn raining. I had to turn back. So I ended up having to cut it short. I walked for 45 minutes nonetheless, but I wanted to do an hour and that did not happen. And I was a little bit upset, you know, because I'm just like, wow, I had it all planned out. But I guess that's what happens sometimes when you make your own plans. It just does not work out the way how you plan it. So, um, yeah. So now what I'm going to do is when I twist my hair back up and like I take it out, I'm going to have a middle part as opposed to the part that I had just now because I don't know what was going on with it. And the twists were not my best to work, honestly. So I want to get that done and then I'll pop back in with you guys a little bit later on. But this is going to take a while and I'm also watching some YouTube along with this. So yeah. Hey guys, so my hair is done and this is what it currently looks like. And then... You know, I'll be able to put it up when I want and like 
leave those two down and just whatever but this is what it looked like i went in and like twisted it smaller i also just got my schedule to go back to work which love that for me i just need to figure out what i'm doing so i had changed my alarm to like seven o'clock that way i can wake up at seven o'clock and have enough time to like work out and like still get ready during this whole time that i've been at home for i've kind of programmed my body to like not eat very early because right now it's 1 12 and i haven't eaten yet and i feel like i can go another hour or two without eating which is good but um i know that when i go back to work like just standing there bored out of my goddamn mind i'm gonna feel like i want to have something to eat i have enough stuff in here though because i went to the grocery store the other day which love that for me so i have fruits that i could take with me and all that stuff so love that today i'm gonna go through my work bag and kind of take some things out and like put some things in just to make sure that it's good to go i was invited supervisor's calling me i'll come back